Ryan, we're looking ahead to Aberdeen on Saturday. How is the moon in the camp in preparation for that one? It's good, I. Um, obviously, when you you win a big game like like Sunday there, it's um, you know obviously helps. Um, we've been on a, a run where we've maybe not scoring a lot of goals, but we you know we definitely look like we're not going to concede a lot as well. So there's there's positives to take, but. Um, I know, mood's up, spirit's good and you know we look forward to another big game at the weekend. Yeah, you mentioned the form's been good recently, six games unbeaten and four clean sheets as well. Is that, you can't really ask for much more from yourself from a defensive point of view. Yeah, of course. I mean, I think everyone has got to chip in the goals, you know, whether that's set plays or, you know, defenders getting forward as well. But, you know, we, you know we're in a good place defensively, you know. It's, you know, I feel really good with the structure of the team just now. I think we're, we're trying to build something and it's, it's coming together slowly, but... You know, you can see the rewards defensively on the pitch with the clean sheets and the, the numbers that we're getting in the last you know month too. Yeah, and in terms of your own performances, what have you made of your game so far this season? I feel, um, you know, this is probably the, the most consistent I've been, you know, throughout my career so far. Um, you know, I feel that the last couple of months I've been, you know, I've been in a really good place and, you know, I think as, um, you know, along with, with Cads as well, I think he's he's been playing playing very well um, as we said, if we keep keeping clean sheets you know the goals are going to come um, you know whether that's as I mentioned there uh, from the defenders from the midfielders everyone's got to chip in but you know we can see we're building something and you know hopefully the, the goals start to come Yeah for sure and you mentioned playing with Cads but you've had to play with a lot of different defenders in that back three or back five how's that been like for you? Um, aye, it's, it's been different uh, usually uh, I was used to you know, playing beside Hanlon and McGinn, you know, in that kind of um, comfy, you know, back three and, and uh, playing beside the same players obviously helps, but it's uh, it's been good, no, it's been different. You know, uh, Louis Stevenson's been asked to play a lot of positions, left wing, back, left centre half, centre mid, and it, it shows uh, the quality he's got and the professionalism that he just gets on with. So now we've, we've got a lot of good players and, you know, it's good to play with to all these boys as well, that they're all hungry, all fighting for places, so it's good. Yeah, obviously, Hannum has been out um, from earlier this year. Have you found you had to, you know, take more responsibility and show your own leadership skills with him being out? Aye, definitely. Um, I think, you know, a lot of the boys have got to take, you know, when you're not on a good bit of form, everybody needs to take responsibility. And, you know, I might not be the oldest in the squad, but, you know, I've, I've played a lot of games, I've played in a lot of big games for the club now, and... You know, I feel like I, you know, I've probably need to take a bit more responsibility on the park. So, especially around the place as well. I mean, uh, we have got a good team, but we've got a young team. Um, so, you know, if I, if I can pass on, you know, any experience from them and, and lead them on and off the park, you know, I'll, I'll um, do my best to try and do that. For sure. And you mentioned goals, and everyone needs to chip in with goals. Last time we played Aberdeen, obviously, you scored that goal. Is that something that you're hoping to contribute more of? Yeah, hopefully. Um, I mean. You know, if the delivery is right and the, um, and the runs are good, you know, well, it's a, it's a good chance to score for set place. Um, so I will be looking to do the same again, see how they set up. But I know, as I say, I'll, I'll just be going into the game, you know, same as always, trying to keep that clean sheet and you know anything else is a bonus. Yeah, and just finally, say finally, it's a massive month for the club. Three big games, including a couple of Edinburgh derbies and a trip back to Hampden Park. How much are you looking forward to the next month? I, you know, they're the games you want to play in. You know, two games against Hearts in a week. It's brilliant for the fans, it's brilliant for the players and for the city as well, it'll be good. Um, so, you know, hopefully we can get a couple of positive results going into that and, you know, we can go into that good form, you know, um, a good energy about the place and, you know, hopefully we can we can progress to the final and, you know, maybe secure fourth place. Cheers, Porter. Thanks, Tom. Perfect. Thanks, mate.